Well, Samsung showing it tonight. They've definitely been showing what they've got. And let's see our MVP tonight. And it is Shine. He says he's been doing well. I think so. Well, well our team lost for the first match for the uh, for this round, so I didn't really feel comfortable. But now I don't have that feeling anymore. Not as asking if he watches best five. And Shine's match was on number one for this week's best of five. Yeah. Well, yeah. Things were out of hand tonight, you know. Uh, we went, uh, they both went to the elimination game. Shine says he likes to play aggressively, he doesn't like block. Well, there were good times and bad times with Shine style. Let's see. And let's see this recap. Well, I didn't expect this to happen, but I tried to. I tried my best, and I had zero drones at this point. It says it was written zero above the hatchery. So I was thinking that you know this is gonna be a really hard game. And I really felt stuffy at this point. Well, we were all expecting an aggressive play from Shine. Let's see what he prepared. Do you guys remember Gangnam Charon? And I thought of this on this map. So I, I played Gangnam Zerg on this map. But there were zero drones, so it didn't really mean anything. It became meaningless. But still, it went to elimination. And Kanata is asking when he thought he might win. Well, you can see there's another base on 6 o'clock. So at this point, I was still nervous. He can say for sure if he would win or lose. Well, up until now, I was still nervous. Both of us were still nervous. But I blew that CC away with Banelings, and I knew that if I concentrate, I could just win. He, wanted, he says he wanted to check uh, Marines with the Mutalists, the number of Marines, and the number of SCVs. And I, I was just concentrating on delaying the uh, minerals. Well, Shine says he wasn't moving around with the Mutalist with no meaning, he just had every meaning on it. Well, Yoda didn't really know how many drones Shine had, so he just had no idea what was coming. Well, not only in SE2, but also in Bird War, Shine had really weird games, you know, that went to eliminations against Pisu. On a two-player map. He says Pathfinder on Pathfinder. And watching that, you know, Kanata thought that Shine has something, you know. He has a know-how for elimination games. I'm not really good at it, but you know, I just, I just go aggressively. Then sometimes I just get my own timing. Not as asking why Shine prefers aggressive players. Well, this has been going on since Bird War. I just like playing aggressively. And I practice focusing on those kind of play styles. Let's see if he wants to change that style. Because there were bad times because of Shine's style. And he says, personally, I just try to concentrate on other things more than aggressive plays, you know. But still, the situation just changed aggressively. I didn't, I didn't want to play aggressively tonight, but look at this. It just happened. Yeah. 
굉장히 좋은 것 같습니다. 벌써 삼성 갤럭시가 이제 3승 1패죠. Well, yeah. Samsung Galaxy is now up uh, with 3-1 yeah. for this round. TGA now they have SK Telecom 2-1 and KT Rolster. Another strong team. Well, our team is really good right now with three winning streaks, but the rest of the teams are really strong, so this is the start for us. But now that we're we're really in good condition, we want we're just looking forward to winning the rounds for this round. He thinks this situation is just perfect. Every teammate is just up to their perfect condition. They're showing what they want to on broadcast matches. Well, I try to I try to show you guys really fun games every time. I'll try to prepare better and show you entertaining games. And this was Shine and Kanada and Sergio. Shine, also a very well-spoken player. He's been around for a while. One of the older guys on the team. And uh, the biggest thing that stuck with me there was that, you know, they're on a three-game winning streak, and they've got a lot of hard teams on the way here. But he said everybody's playing the way they want to. You know, sometimes you go into a broadcast and match, you get nervous. You don't, you, you hear a lot of players say, oh, I only played like 50% of my potential. But he says everybody's playing like their best right now. And that puts them in the best possible position to possibly take wins against KT, SKT, etc. So really excited for Samsung Galaxy Con to possibly do better here in round number two. Yeah, very interesting that he that he did say that. And I look forward to seeing uh, other players like Solar, etc. see if they can come back and start getting some wins under their belt. Yeah, man. Guilty, maybe. Yeah. Make a second appearance. Maybe, man. I would love to see that, man. That'd be fantastic. Well, guys, this first matchup was kind of just the warm-up for today. Prime versus Samsung Galaxy Khan. Up next, we got Jin Air Greenings versus KT Rolster. And this is going to be a crazy one, man. This is totally just oh, out of control. Well, Every single match. Yeah, look at all those those upward arrows. Everyone is just doing fantastic in the uh, both of these teams. Starting with Rogue versus Life. Guess what? Life won a tournament yesterday. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> it's, it's getting insane, man. That I have to swear sometimes. Yeah, it, it's actually insane. I mean, Rogue, I think he got round of eight in uh, SSL, Zest, and Trap, getting to the finals of IEM. World Championships, Cure, I think he got round of eight somewhere. Stats got round of four. Yeah. All of these guys are doing incredibly well these days. Oh, man. I'd say, I guess, SOS versus Flash, They those are the two players not having the biggest like individual results. But, you know, here in Pro League, they're doing decently well as they're, well. They're doing well for themselves. And, yeah, I, I can see this one. I see this one going to an ace match. This one is going to be great, guys. I promise Stay you. tuned. Tell your friends. Get on Twitter. We'll be right back after a 10-minute break. Stay tuned.